Welcome to Module 3. In this module, you'll learn how to navigate the Patients function on the navigation bar. The Patients module defaults to Assigned Patients. To see all patients in the unit, tap Assigned Units. Assign a patient to yourself by tapping the toggle next to the patient name. Now, when you tap Assigned Patients, you'll notice a star icon next to the patient name. This means the patient is assigned to you. If you see a C in parentheses, this means the patient is confidential. And if you don't have access, you will not see their first name, last name, date of birth, or gender. To unassign a patient, simply tap the patient's name again and toggle the slider. Now we'll look at patient details to see additional information about our patient. Tap Patient Details. Here we can see the information on our patient's age, gender, admission date, lengths of stay, and chief complaint. Navigate back to the previous screen by tapping the back arrow in the upper left corner. Under the Dynamic Care team, you'll see all the members caring for the patient. If you tap on a member's name, you can see their contact details, and from here, you can text or call them. When a patient assigned to you has new lab results, you'll see a lab icon next to the patient's name. This icon will expire after four hours. Tap the patient's record to view the results. Tap Lab Results. Then, choose a specific lab result to view the lab details. Under Lab Values, tap a specific lab value to view the lab item. Lab results will be displayed differently depending on the values associated. Results that are displayed with red text mean that one or more values are critically high or critically low. Critical lab results must be shared verbally with the provider. Lab results that are within the normalized range will appear in black text. If applicable, you'll see a notes section. To view a previous lab result for the same lab test, tap History. You'll see a graphical representation of the history of this test's lab results. Tap the back arrow to return to the lab detail screen. Lab results can be sent to other contacts on the care team. From the lab detail screen, tap the plus sign. Tap send. You'll be prompted to select a contact. A sent confirmation will be displayed. Note that this step does not replace any critical lab notification policies at your facility. This concludes Module 3. In the next module, you'll learn about texting, group texts, broadcasts, contacts, favorites, and alerts. Please close this browser tab to return to HealthStream.